Hello everyone, I am Dr. Pratik. In this video, I am going to describe arthroscopic saucerization procedure for incomplete discoid lateral meniscus. A discoid meniscus is an abnormally developed meniscus which is hypertrophic and discoid in shape. It is relatively common problem which involves 3 to 5 percent of population. Usually the lateral meniscus is more involved than medial meniscus. Patient is usually in his or her adolescence and complains of pain in the knee with clicking and mechanical locking sensation. X-ray might show widening of the joint space with squaring of the lateral condyle and cupping of the lateral tibial plate too, with hypoplastic lateral intercondylar spine. Diagnosis is confirmed with an MRI scan which shows three or more 5mm sagittal images with meniscal continuity known as bow tie sign. Vatanep classification classifies discoid meniscus in three types. Type 1 is complete discoid meniscus, type 2 is incomplete and type 3 is when there is lack of posterior meniscotibial attachment to the tibia. Treatment is non-operative to begin with whenever the patient is asymptomatic or with minimal symptoms. But when patient is symptomatic with pain and locking sensation, we should consider partial meniscectomy and saucerization procedure with or without meniscus repair. Our case is a 16 year old boy with left knee joint pain with locking sensation. On MRI he was found to be having incomplete type 2 lateral discoid meniscus without tear. So we are going to perform partial meniscectomy and saucerization procedure for this patient. 